Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm actually going to be showing you guys how to fix the sets. I just figured this out and nobody else has this, so if you actually do make a video on this, please credit me because I actually spent, like, not even joking, like 13 days working on it. And now that I finally figured it out, um, yeah, it's pretty cool. So, first things first, what you want to do is you want to make sure that you already watched my how to add your archive tutorial up here. Uh, if you did, then and you already have this, perfect. If you don't, then go watch it, set it up real quick. It's not very really hard. And then what you want to do is you want to come to your any set, for example, the Santa set, and you want to scroll down. You want to change it from set to what I told you to bundle, and then bundled items. You want to click on that. Go to your Playfab, and then as you can see, there is Santa beard. So you want to copy this paste it in here and then copy the Santa hat and put it in here and then you want to go to your uh, playfab again click on Santa beard and set up the currency down here the price currency set it to 5000 or whatever you want to make sure that this is this set is an even number so that you can divide the divide the prices into two pieces so for this it's also two pieces so then I would make the Santa hat 5,000 and the beards 5,000, which I did here. <coughs> 5,000 and 5,000. And then you want to come over here to the bundles, search up Santa, and then go to Santa set. Scroll down. And then make the currency, the currency that you want it to have. And then bundle contents. If it isn't already like this, you should, uh, you have to set it up like this. And then click save bundle then all you have to do is set everything else up like the item name and display name and stuff and then if you if you go into the play mode and set it up correctly and you go over here and buy it let me show you that I would um, do it but I have to do it with the vampire set or the wolf set or something so I'll be right back so here I'm gonna do this with the vampire set I'm gonna scroll down go to my playfab go to economy catalogs go here and then I'm gonna filter it out and put it to vampire and I'm gonna I'm gonna make each set 10,000 so I'm gonna I'm gonna do this shiny rocks and then 10,000 divided by 3 is 3,300 so we're just gonna do that save item and then do it for every other vampire thing Oopsie. Save item. SR. Save item. And then I'm going to go to the bundle. Go here. And then make this 10,000. And then if you just click save bundle. And then set it up in here. So I'm going to go back again and copy this. Item slot, we're gonna do bundle here, vampire, vampire set, display name, vampire set, just like that. Make sure it's in all caps and just like the display name in there. And then cost 10,000. Bundled items, we're gonna add three. And then we are going to go back here, go to items, and then right here. We're going to copy this, put it in here, copy, oopsie, I opened the wrong, uh, copy this, put it in here, and then go back and copy the last one, and then put it in here. Make sure can try on is on for every single one as well. And then if you go ahead and change this to set. 10, 1, 2, 3, boom. Now, if you click play and you already did everything and everything works. <coughs> okay, so now if we go over here, go to the vampire set, and then if we go here, test press, make sure it's on just like that, and then go down here. Don't ask why I have so many shiny rocks, I gave myself some. And then if we select this, it's going to be vampire set 10,000. 
yes are you really sure yes and then it says success enjoy your new item if you go here you will have all of the cosmetics from the bundle as you can see working and enableable so yeah i hope you enjoyed and i'll see you next time bye bye